Hey guys, Jonathan Stewart here for About.com. Designer handbags can be an amazing accent to an outfit, but for the price they often demand, they can also be an amazing mortgage payment. Fortunately or unfortunately, this fact keeps the knockoff business in full swing, and imitations can sometimes look pretty real. But take a look at the following tips, and you'll never be fooled again. Check it out. Tip 1. Materials. Fake purses used to look a lot like plastic toys, even from a distance. But with stiff competition for the bargain basement market, quality has actually gone up, although the materials used to make these clones remains a dead giveaway. Top grade leather is usually soft and pliable. Imitation materials tend to bend in funny places and are often misshapen or unevenly colored. Take a good look at the stitching as well. Keep an eye out for sloppy craftsmanship in hidden places such as pockets or corners inside of the bag. Real designer purses are more expensive in part because of their extremely detailed construction, which just can't be matched by the mass-produced counterfeits. The designer versions are also exorbitantly expensive, well, because people still buy them. Tip 2. The label. Think of the label as the artist's signature on a painting. This is generally something that will be carefully sewn into a purse's interior. If you see a cheaply made tag, or one that is misspelled or in a font that differs from the official logo, it's a pretty good sign you're looking at a fake. Although I gotta tell you, I have a pair of Jorge Armano pants that look just like the real thing. And polyester. Tip 3. The box. If you're buying a purse from a guy at a stand on the street and given a Trader Joe's bag to carry it home in, chances are good it's a fake. Real designer handbags are generally packed in tissue in an official brand name box and often come with an equally well-crafted dust bag. Finally, genuine products usually come with a booklet that describes the quality of your handbag's detail. If this is absent, it's one last good sign it's a forgery. You should also check the handles, zippers, and anything else that might not catch the eye right away. And if you're trying to pass off your own fake handbag as real, your best tactic is to probably just wave your arms around a lot and hang out in really, really dark places. Thanks for watching. To learn more, visit us on the web at about.com.